the value of art and the value of music is the thing we want to have the most impact on students' minds. That there is more to art in our lives than, than just a mere fancy. And there's more to it than just theory. I was so excited about having a time to just incubate and write new work, which has been very different for me. So I've spent a lot of weeks just really investigating myself and my ideas of music, but not restricting myself to any instrumental group or into, into any particular outcome. I worked with a year nine class in a, in a kind of songwriting class which was a great way for them to access that idea of composition because that's songs are a very easy and notable thing for us to understand because all the kids are listening to songs all the time. And the girls came up with some great ideas and some of the quietest girls made some really bold sounds. In every groove with, a, say, bass and drums, you can shrink it down to its tiniest form, almost compress it, if you like, and it'll still have motion, which could be just, you know, a, a peak every 10 seconds in a, in a long note of stillness, can you make that feel like it has the same energy as a loud ensemble with lots of vast dynamics going on? That's been my challenge. One of the pieces that I wrote called Paris After the War, it came out of those moments of real still, just the simplest little idea. And how often can you repeat that? Dee da 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 da. Dee dee da da. That little line. And I was exploring the school and in the library and saw a book on post-war art in, in Paris. And I'd recently come back from Europe before I started this residency. And the idea of this particular quiet sound that I was making, and it all seemed to come together in this idea of how you take that simple little motif and then just start to kind of mirror it and shadow it with other things that look and sound slightly like it, but not quite. And just how long can you keep that going before and then it finally it grows into this, this story, which ended up being my ideas of of Paris, the, the nice, the everyday, the calm, the ordinary, and then the sounds of chaos, the sound of an air raid siren saying there's, there's something chaotic on the way. And then following that, the idea of a voice came to me, which was a, a, a solo voice saying the sky is falling. I got the chance to have that piece played at Government House and some of the students came along and got to hear it play and hopefully make it prove the context. If there's a way in which students could be able to experience their own music both as performers and writers of music and not feel like it's critical to their assessment just so they can be a little freer, it, maybe it might free up the imagination a little more.